I hope you clicked on this video because you want to learn how you can make money investing out of state. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Welcome to another episode of the MLS Search and Analysis Show. I'm James Wise. You're watching Holton Wise TV. If you are looking to learn how you can make money investing in out-of-state real estate, hit the subscribe button. If you clicked on this video to learn how to make money, that's great, man, because that's what we are doing here today. It's what we do all the time. That's why I told you to hit that subscribe button, man. Or you could check us out on other social media platforms. Wherever you want to get your Holton Wise TV is fine by me. We help people just like you. Invest in real estate in profitable markets. And unlike other folks, right, we don't just give you like this theoretical education where it's like, hey, man, pay us X amount of dollars. We'll teach you all this stuff. Here you go. Here's the package. And then we kick you in the ass, send you on your way, right? No, no, no. It's not like that because what happens is I think a lot of people find out that uh, – a lot of things that you're taught in theory work well in theory, work great, sound good in a course, but they don't necessarily work in the real world, right? So what we do is a little different, right? We try to combine that education with actual real-life deals, kind of put the whole thing together in a little real estate stew for you, right? So what you're watching right now is a video I'm filming specifically for my client, Bill Al. Uh, Out-of-state investor, Bill, you come to me from Kansas City, brother, and I'm here to help you build a portfolio in Cleveland, right? While I'm building you this portfolio, I hope these videos that I give to you uh, are going to teach you a little something about the Cleveland market and the business in general along the way. And uh, to those other folks out there I was talking to that are uh, wanting to get in the game like Bill, I want you guys to know something. What you're seeing right now is a video that Bill has been sent privately a couple months ago, right? So the property I'm about to get into for Bill, you guys can't buy it. It's not available, right? If you're watching this on Holton Wise TV publicly and you're not Bill Al, you're just seeing this to understand how the business works, how we work, how the market works. You know, hopefully you're learning. If you want to work with us one-on-one -on -one in real time like he is, send us an email, sales at holdenwise.com. Includes your phone number. We'll call you, talk to you about the process of getting your own customized videos like Bill. Bill, I to you, brother. Uh, thank you for sitting through that. Uh, you know, got to keep the lights on here, dog, so I got to keep keep the, the new folks coming in, bro. Uh, but for you, dude, uh, I shot you several videos uh, over the last couple days here. Um, just trying to find you some good, solid uh, properties for your portfolio, right? Give you multiple options, right? I know you're probably not going to want to make offers on every single one of the ones I've sent you this week, but the idea is to give you a wide range of options that I think will work good based on the criteria you've given me and have you pick uh, the best one or two that makes sense for you right now, right? It's a numbers game, dude. We're investing in real estate. Every deal is not going to make sense, but I, I want you to have as much information as you can before you make your decision, okay? And the property I got for you here, I, <coughs> I know you talked to me. About C and D properties, this is like a little nicer. I just thought this was a really good asset that you should take a look at. Uh, so I want to show you some footage of when I uh, originally analyzed this property for another investor. I was doing a, a handful of properties for him, giving him options, and we went a different route. So this one's very much available, and I thought it should go across your desk. So after you take a look at this footage, let me know if you want to make an offer. 15505 Benhoff Maple Heights. Now, this is also the most expensive, $89,000. However, I told you in the previous three videos, my goal for you is to get at least one of these four for the price point of 75 k right? So no matter what, all four of these, all varying prices, I think we offer 75 k on every one of them that you're interested in. If this is the one we can take down, uh, that'd be great. All very similar build. This one, 1948. You know, we dealt with like a 1950, 1953, right? All very similar mid-century stuff instead of the turn of century. We actually have some photos on this one, which we haven't had for the other ones. This is also tenant occupied. As far as the rent, it's uh, $1,020 a month, $12,240 a year, right? Of the $12,240 that comes in, I anticipate you spending approximately $8,000 of that, leaving you with four. 
209 right again the prices uh the costs on these properties uh they're going to be a little bit more expensive because maple heights has an incredibly high tax rate right your cash flow is getting eaten up by that three thousand one hundred eleven dollar property tax bill uh you got to take the good with the bad jeff unfortunately that's just uh, how the cookie crumbles right but the rents are pretty high one thing i want to mention to you about the rent on this particular property though i have 1020 the rent is technically 945 plus they have the tenant paying their water sewer bill at Holton Wise, if we were to take this over, we don't do it that way. We would add the 75 into their rent at 1020 The reason we do this is because the way the landlord-tenant laws are written in Ohio and the way the Cleveland Division of Water works, you can't effectively charge your tenant for water sewer separately. It carries with the land, gets added to your tax bill. You can't really evict them for that, and that's non with COVID standing, right? That's before COVID. More information on all that is in my FAC. Go to HoltonWise.com, click the property management FAC. Uh, but six to one, half dozen the other, right? You find these low, uh, lowly, you know, low involved, low portfolio, uh, like these, these, these. I guess what I'm trying to say is you find these. These uh, property managers that are have very small businesses, they're new to the business, or these owner-occupied, uh, not owner-occupied, uh, owner-managed, mom-and-pop landlords or property managers that only have a couple properties, uh, they try to just have the tenants pay it, and they, they don't have enough experience to understand why that won't work, right? So they do things like charge the tenant 945 but make them pay their own water sewer bill well we have thousands and thousands of tenants so that doesn't work we know why it doesn't work we've experienced that type of stuff so we do it a little differently again that's on the fact but six to one half dozen the other the way it's gonna pencil out dude eight grand is your expenses 4209 is what i believe will be your noi okay and let's cruise through some of the rest of the photos before i get into the uh, roi right hey lenders our investors are looking to work with you. Send us an email at sales at holtonwise.com. This property is probably very similar to what the other three are going to look like inside. I know we were missing some photos on those, uh, but they're all like going to be the same layout, right? I don't anticipate anything being very different, right? This is an upstairs. This is like a very typical upstairs bungalow in these types of cities. Uh, this is pretty cool though, right? We got newer Home Depot Lowe's quality cabinetry. So like when the next turnover comes in this property, not going to deal with a lot of stuff. Updated electric panel right there. Uh, pretty darn new furnace, okay? Pretty darn new hot water tank, man. So this one's got all the big ticket items taken care of. That roof looks pretty good as well. So I would say this is probably the nicest property of the four, but I still don't want you to pay 89 brother. I think we can go ahead and get at least one of these at that price point of 75 k If this is the one we get at 75 k it'll pencil out to a 5.6 cap or a 7.3% cash on cash return. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.